I would say probably like everything added up to about 615 hours, something like that. So do I have y'all permission to air your images on various media outlets? Okay, so I'm creating a documentary. It's a five-year follow-up of different issues and concerns. And I chose to pick this camera up because I overheard y'all conversation. Um, and you, you're a vet. Yes. And Simone is thinking, of, well, she's going into the Air Force. When are you going into the Air Force? In September. And she's very excited. That's really cool. But I picked the camera up because you said the military isn't for everybody. Yes. And why do you say that? Because uh, when I serve, uh, some people do not have the, uh, I would say, makeup. Maybe the, um, your, some people aren't disciplined enough. Some people, um, people that have a problem with authority usually have a really hard time in the military. All those guys that I went in boot camp with, they didn't make it. They didn't graduate boot camp because they had issues with the uh, company commander and whatnot. So it just takes a certain type to be able to get in and listen to her. She is that certain type because, you know, she's, yeah, not, she's, she's just not, her she's dad and being <laughs> and disciplined and, uh, you know, doing, doing things of that yeah. nature. So it's not for everybody. Like like my oldest son, he's not disciplined enough and uh, he, has, he doesn't have a problem with authority, but I think he would react a certain way, which might not be favorable to, favorable to him. Okay. And what branch, what branch were you in? I was in the Navy. And your name is? David. 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 Yes. Thank you for your service. Thank you. You're welcome. And why are you going in the service, Simone? Because it's kind of like, why not? They kind of set you up for life, and it should be a good experience for me. I like to, I want to travel. I like the money. The benefits are nice. So. What do you mean they set you up for life? Um. Well, like with the pay, they pay for housing. Like if you go into school, they help you out with tuition, medical, dental, anything that normal people have to worry about. The military basically takes care of it for you. Okay. And you're going to go to college? Or are you looking for the GI Bill? Yeah. Do that's awesome. They have a nice GI Bill now, too. They have the uh, post 9 11 GI Bill is the best yeah, one. Yeah, I was reading on that. Yeah. But and the military is a nice stepping stone. And um, there's a lot of countries in my travels that military is mandatory for at least two years. And I think if they enforce they really can't do that. But if they did, I think a lot of people, it would be better. This <laughs> country, let's put it that way, if you did a couple years in the military. It would be, be a good thing. And what branch did you serve? Navy. Navy. Did eight years. Awesome. Thank you for your service. How do you feel when people say thank you for your service? Um, I feel really good about it because uh, soldiers and uh, military that went in before I did, um, especially the old vets from World War II, World War I, and the Vietnam vets, they didn't get, always get the support. Right. Uh, people, I guess, didn't understand at the time, and now they do. So a lot of the troops are, are getting a lot of support. I see in the news a lot of times they're, they set up things for the soldiers to talk to, get in touch with their family. That stuff really wasn't really going on when I was. So things are changing and they're moving in the right direction. And uh, it feels good as a vet that you're, you're, you're uh, you, you give up something that people are behind you and they, uh, they say that with honesty. So I feel good when you say that. That's awesome. And I heard you saying thank you to Simone because she's a volunteer doing your taxes this year. Yes. And what made you say thank you to her? Because she's volunteering, taking time out on uh, her busy schedule to, uh, you know, help somebody out that's in need or, you know, needs help. Um, and that's greatly appreciated. It's very, very uh, parallel to, you know, to anybody that volunteers. It's, 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 a, it's a good thing. Thank you so much. Would you like to say anything else, Simone? I know you're working hard over there preparing <laughs> his taxes. How long have you been volunteering as a tax preparer? Four years. Four years? Three, four years. That's awesome. That's so awesome. You're going to be doing military taxes soon. <laughs> <laughs> Helping out my fellows. Yeah. So I just want to get y'all email addresses if that's okay. okay. So I can email y'all when I... Um,